Okay, here we have a bunch of graphs, different things, lots of labels. So wave has all these things, period, wavelength, and amplitude. The wave is shown on a graph of displacement against distance. Okay, that is very important. What is on your x-axis? Look carefully. Distance. Distance, 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 distance. Okay, so with that, please bear in mind that distance is, you know, meters. It's a length. It is a length. So if you look at what is measured on the x-axis, one complete cycle. Let's look at uh, solution A. Which one is correctly labeled, huh? One complete wave cycle that is wavelength lambda in terms of meters. Is it a distance? Yes, it is. So it matches. Okay, very good. Next, we check all. T here is period in terms of seconds. So that is something wrong already. Why is this measurement second but the axis is in meters? Although we're talking about one complete cycle. Yeah, but uh, no. That's not correct. So we can do the same for C. You look at period. Um, period is second. Why? Distance is in meters. The units don't match. So we're left with choices A and D. What's the difference? Difference is A. A is amplitude. So amplitude is also known as the maximum displacement from the middle. Okay, displacement is from the middle. Huh? So from... Equilibrium, also known as x equals to zero. So you look at all the measurements. Well, the best we can go with is this one, which is from the middle upwards. This a down here, not correct. This is two times the amplitude, so it's not correct. Best choice we can go with a. Okay, so make sure you know the two the, the, the labels on the graphs that help you to read and understand the graphs. Okay, that's all for this question. See you in the next one.